Hey guys, Blake here with another video and I'm super excited today because we are allowed to go visit some Melbourne suburbs aquarium stores yet again. So uh, first port of call, I went to Aquapet, which is in Derrimut. There'll be a map on the screen now, but um, yeah, I had a great old time visiting and uh, let's run through what they've got to offer. Let's jump straight into the video. Okay, so as we move to Aquapet, we're greeted with the huge uh, display tank in here with a uh, Saratoga Giardini, a bunch of blood parrots, stingrays, and a really nice ornate baisha there. Really impressive way to uh, walk into a aquarium store, I think for sure. Um, a lot of people have mixed opinions but on blood parrots, but I actually really like these guys here. And then we've got some nice planted aquarium displays as well. Forktail blue eyes in that one. Then we've got discus and neon tetras, a classic mix, and a really, really nice, beautiful discus there. And um, then we move into the store. We got these albino hecalas, and I'm waving at you there to say good day. It's really hard. There was some glare that I was contending with there, but really nice looking um, fish here, and yeah, some great specimens. Then we go through and have a bit of a look at the dry goods. We've got plenty of uh, ornaments and decorations, driftwood of all different uh, sizes and types of wood. Chemicals uh, to please your heart's desire. We've got heaps of nets and uh, little connectors and all sorts of good stuff in there, air stones. Pumps and filters. Uh, we've got some aquascaping tools as well. Uh, I think those are actually um, some saltwater tools as well. We've got tropical foods, really good foods. We've got sea chem products there, API products, New Life Spectrum, so there's a brand for everybody and uh, I'm sure you'll be able to find what you're looking for. Then these are the Aquapet line of tanks, they do some small tanks uh, pretty affordably really and some larger tanks as well that you can custom order. So as that we've got lights and we also have some feathered friends as well, so we've got two Eclectus parrots there that I guess are um, the, the store pets or something like that. Then we've got two better barracks and we head around starting with some discus. Uh, we've got adults and uh, baby discus as well, so sort of can adjust to your price point and, and what you're looking for. If you want something that's gonna be ready to breed straight away, you could go, go the whole hog and get some adults, or otherwise, you know, there's some smaller discus there that you can choose and grow out in a, in a nice aquarium. Moving around, uh, this next side has some more of the intermediate, so we've got some ghost knives here, brown and black. There's angelfish as well. These are really cool barbs, um, oratus barbs I think they're called, but I've never seen those before. We've got some red rainbow fish as well. Uh, these really nice chocolate gouramis too. Cool, cool little gourami, you don't see that often. Got another display tank here with some angels and some other barbs. And then we head around into sort of more the big bulky uh, cichlids and that sort of thing. So we've got um, all sorts of things from Oscars, flower horns, African cichlids such as peacocks, um, haps as well. And just pretty much a lot of the fish that a lot of people check. Oh, there's also a blue um, yabby or crayfish. Um, so yeah, we've got some, uh, some pe peacocks here. A uh, really nice looking flower horn there and um, some, yeah, some pretty good sized clown leeches as well actually, which I was, it's not that easy to find um, clown leeches as big as what some of them were. So we've got some Oscars here as well. Um, this is a wood cat, driftwood cat. We've got some albino Oscars as well. And um, yeah, there's all other sorts of cichlids as well. Oh, <laughs> I thought this was interesting that the cribs were all just huddled up, not moving. Um, I guess they thought I couldn't see them if they don't move. Got some flag tails as well. But yeah, there's all sorts of things from sort of green terrors and, and uh, other big Americans, Jack Dempsey's and, and the like. And then there's this single turtle here as well. And that kind of rounded out um, what's there in store. So there you go guys, that was Aquapet. Um, yeah, certainly recommend if you're in the area and you like what you saw, definitely pop in and say good day to the guys there at Aquapet. So thanks to them for having me, letting me film and do all that fun stuff. I had a ball and uh, I'll catch you on the next video. If you like this one, it always helps me out to smash like, hit subscribe and all that fun stuff. Other than that, I'll catch you on the next one. Thanks for watching.